In this example, we have an isosceles triangle with a base of 5 and a perpendicular height of 6. Now, what we could do to work out the centroid is to find, let's say, the midpoint of this side. And then, once I've got the midpoint, go two-thirds of the way along the median to that point, And then I've got my coordinates of my centre of mass. However, don't forget that because the shape is symmetric, that means that the centre of mass must lie on this line. And that is going to be 2.5. So we know that the x-coordinate of the centre of mass is going to have x-coordinate 2.5. It's got to be on that line. Now this is itself a median, and it's of length 6. So two-thirds of the way down would be 4. So that means if that distance is 4, that distance is 2. So the centre of mass must be at 2.5. So don't forget to utilise the properties of the shape you're working with.